Now we are facing some unseasonably warm weather, relatively speaking, for northwest Ohio, but we all know colder stuff is on the way. For many people, that means plugging in that extra heated blanket. Dan Cummins loves doing that. Lighting candles, which Melissa likes doing, or busting out those space heaters. Let's check in with meteorologist Matt Willoughby. He joins us live to explain the steps that you can take to be fire safe this winter. Matt? Yeah, Jeff, house fires are dangerous no matter when they happen, but they definitely become more common as the temperature dips. According to the Oregon Fire Department, house fires increase between the fall and winter months, with peaks in December and January. While these stats are scary, there's a lot you can do to keep yourself safe this winter. Always having working smoke detectors is huge. Um, having an extinguisher in kitchens, um, even two extinguishers inside a household can be beneficial. Servicing um, heating equipment, um, all those items can be huge and beneficial toward the prevention of residential fires. One of the best ways to protect yourself and your family from a house fire is by working smoke alarms in your house. Only 50 56% of homeowners across America have smoke alarms. Smoke alarms are an early sign of fire, and it'll give you that proper warning as you go throughout this winter as well. So make sure you do follow these, t these tips to keep you safe as you go throughout this winter and this holiday season. Reporting in Oregon, I'm meteorologist Matt Willoughby for W2All 11.